Hello, everyone. Hello. How are we doing? <laughs> we are so excited to be here in our post Chagim world. Don't we look so relaxed? <laughs> The holidays were phenomenal. It was so wonderful to be with so many of you on Rosh Hashanah, Yom Kippur, Sukkot, and Torah. Uh, thank you to everyone who came out in person, who watched on the live stream and on Zoom. And it's always just so wonderful to be together in community. So good, so good. And uh, uh, we're excited to offer everyone an opportunity to take one more step with us. Something revolutionary is happening <laughs> here. We are very, very excited to announce the start of the Rabbi's Ruben. Rubenstein Book Club. Rabbi's Rubenstein Book Club. <laughs> Toge was excited. Together we are going to be reading a book with all of you, discussing it, pulling, together. Out, pulling out the Jewish texts and the sources and studying it together, um, and really just giving us all an opportunity to take that one more step, take that first step into Torah learning in an accessible um, and easy way together. And what's wonderful is most classes are either taught by me or Rabbi Rachel. This is going to be both of us together. You get two rabbis the price of one two for one what a deal you gotta snag this while you can get it, get bogo it, buy get one it. get one bogo that, it took me a while to know what bogo means but okay <laughs> payless always had bogo <laughs> but okay, now you have temple of Baron bogo temple two Baron rabbis bogo. um so what are we learning what, are we what doing? book will we be doing we are going to be reading this phenomenal phenomenal book it is called judaism is about love it was written by rabbi shy held who is i think both of us consider to be one of our great rabbis yeah one of the great rabbis rabbis of uh, egalitarian traditional Judaism. He's like incredible. He is um, brilliant, compassionate, accessible, all of the great things that you would want in a rabbi. He's got it all and we are so excited to be reading this book together. This is his book that is about, um, the thesis of the book is that Judaism is about love. That sometimes we think um, that, you know, Christianity is about a God that loves you. Get your hands in Christianity is about a, a God that loves you and Judaism is about something else. Judaism is about justice or Judaism is about um, action or Judaism is about something else. Um, but if if I say to you, God loves you, and you feel like that doesn't feel like a Jewish statement, um, Rabbi Shai Held may change your mind as we explore this book together. Don't be intimidated by the uh, by the size of it. It is really accessible and wonderful, and, and I think it'll be really great for us to dive in together. Um, and P.S. about like 200 pages of it is footnotes. So don't be worried about, about the, size, the, footnotes. About the okay. size of it. It's, a, it's not, don't be intimidated. It's a really wonderful book, and we're excited yeah. to delve in. And there's something really exciting about it too yeah so i just want to explain a little bit like what we're going to be doing because we're not going to only just be reading the book we're really going to be looking into the texts uh, we'll be bringing during the discussion i'll be bringing the texts that underpin his argument so we can understand the sources that he brings in themselves and learn from them and also i think rabbi rachel will really help by bringing the nafkamina what like what, what does that mean for our actual lives what are we supposed to take from this how can we actually act with love and chesed in our own lives I think what Rabbi Rachel is hinting at here is not only are we going to be learning this incredible book over an extended amount of time to be able to apply it to our lives, but at the end of this, guess what, my friends? <laughs> the Rabbi Shai Held himself will be coming right here to Temple of Aaron, right in the springtime. It's going to be incredible. At the end of our book club, we'll finish, and as a gift, he'll come to us, and guess what? If you learn with us, you'll get a special meeting with Rabbi Shai Held, where we can share all of our insights that we learned from his book and ask our pressing questions that I'm sure we'll have. Which he's very excited to do. He um, he said that's, that's going to be the highlight. I mean, he's going to be teaching uh, throughout the weekend, um, but he is most excited to be able to have a small group discussion with people who really learned the book, uh, to challenge him, to ask questions, to discuss with him. Um, he's excited, we're excited, and I hope you're excited too. Um, so we will be uh, assigning uh, chapters, different chapters that we can read in advance and then come together um, and we will go through together. It's going to be offered at noon, not every Thursday, but once or twice a month on Thursdays. We'll send you the schedule um, uh, at noon on Zoom. So if you're working and you want to take one hour to do a little bit of learning with us on Zoom, this is a perfect opportunity to do so. Um, we've offered noon Zoom classes um, in the past and the feedback has been phenomenal. People say it's an amazing way. That you can bring your lunch, you can have take a little lunch break from work um, and do a little bit of Torah learning. It's a great way to take that one more step, infuse a little bit of Torah learning into your week. Incredible. I can't wait to learn with you. 
Yeah. I'm excited. Are you so excited? our first one will be on November yeah. 21st. It's going to be at noon on Zoom. You can email Kristen Johnson at templeofaaron.org to sign up. Um, uh, so please do so, Kristen Johnson at templeofaaron.org, um, or you can email one of us and we'll forward it along. Um, and we can't wait to learn with you. November 21st, noon on Zoom. May God bless us that we all become more kind and loving people to each other because of this study. Amen. Thanks, everyone.